Para decir, ¿eh? ¡Ay, tú la ya! ¡Está la misma! Ya dejen de hacer relajo, por favor. Cállense, cállense. Uh, oh my God, that was bad. Bueno. No sé, no. <risa> ¿Qué pasó? <risa> Nada, mis. Todo bien, somos niños bien nosotros. I know, I know. Mira, voy a apagar la cámara un momentito porque sí siento que se me está. Eh... Se me derrite, mis. It's, it's, se me está derritiendo la antena con ese calor que está haciendo. Ya. Yeah. Me dicen esto. Por razón oímos recording in progress. Lento. <risa> bueno, anyways, I was saying before. Oh my God, está. Eh, yo creo que el calor que está haciendo me está derritiendo la antena. Está así todo raro. Pero bueno, qué bueno que ya estamos aquí. Good thing we're here. Good thing we're about to start. Vamos a iniciar. Así que so we're going to start with the attendance. O sea, yo dándoles tiempo a los que no se habían conectado que se conectaran, ¿verdad? Yo, tan, tan buena gente, ¿verdad? Le, le. Bueno, o mi internet, mi internet era el que les estaba dando la, la, la el chance, right? Ok, thank you, thank you, thank you. Bueno, vamos a continuar aquí. We're going to continue. We're going to go with the attendance. Esperemos que el internet no falle para nada porque quiero tener un récord perfecto esta vez. Siempre me da algún problemita, pero ahora quiero sacar justo, justo, justo cuando ha dicho que terminemos. Así que, let's go, let's start. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present. Perfecto. Blanca Isabel Tunaca de Rodríguez. Present, Miss. Cándida Luz Ortiz de Escalante. Carlos Alberto Meléndez Rosales. Venga para acá, mi amor. <ríe> los audios, recuerden los audios, ¿verdad? Esclelia Estela Flores Hernández. Present. Carlos no está, ¿verdad? Qué raro eso. Ok, Eric Giovanni Jiménez Canizales. Present, Miss. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Present, Miss. Fernando Salvador Figueroa Rosales. Jacobo de Jesús Gómez Gómez. Present, Miss. Jenny Carolina Vázquez de Medrano. Johnny Alexander Escobar Calderón. Present, Miss. Jonathan José Oliva Enríquez. Present, Miss. José Alfredo Hueso López. Present, Miss. Jocelyn Angelina Ramírez Melgar. Present. Julio César Aguillón Arevalo. Present. María Julia Ramos Olívar. Present, Miss. Miguel Ángel Romero Hernández. Present, Miss. Oscar René Molina Calidonio. Presente. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Present, Miss. Rafael Antonio Martínez Navarrete. Present, Miss. Ramiro Rafael Aguilar Díaz. Present, Miss. Ruth Guadalupe Asensio Arevalo. Sandra Yanira Gómez Romero. Present, Miss. Silvia Patricia Aceituno Méndez. Present, Miss. Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas. Present, Miss. Ok, perfect. A ver quiénes me faltan. Carlos. Fernando. Jenny, ahí está. Solo Carlos y Fernando, ¿verdad? I think they are the only ones. Ok, perfect. Ok, now, voy a encender mi cámara con fe de que no se me vaya a trabar este internet. Ay, no, se me olvidó que tengo audífonos. Póngaselos, no hay problema. Ah, gracias, te dice. <laughs> ok. <laughs> Thank so, you. <laughs> don't worry. Ok, <laughs> so we're going to continue. And as you know, uh, now we're talking about the past, right? Estamos, estamos hablando un poquito del past y el past es un tema let's say pretty simple, es un tema bastante sencillo pero eh, tenemos que saber identificar el pasado en dos tiempos right eh, no en dos tiempos, en dos formas sería tenemos los regular verbs y los irregular verbs, yo creo que este tema ustedes ya lo han visto, ¿me equivoco? los verbos regulares y los verbos irregulares que se les agrega ed al final del verbo 
¿no? Haven't? Yes, ¿verdad? Sí, me acuerdo que sí, ya había explicado algo así. Ok, so we have the regulars and we have the regular verbs. También tenemos el pasado simple del verbo to be. Y tenemos el pasado, o sea, ya un poco el pasado, the verb in the past, y el verb be, eh, verb, be, verb, be, verb be. Más que todo, el, el, me está pidiendo aquí que hablemos de el verb be. Así que vamos a empezar hablando un poquito sobre el pasado del verbo to be. Es algo que ya conocemos, esto básicamente solo es como para reforzar lo que ya sabemos, ¿ok? Just to make a reinforcement about it. El verbo to be, que ya sabemos, significa ser o estar, en el presente tiene tres formas, ¿verdad? Tenemos am, tenemos is, y a ver si alguien me dice el siguiente que tenemos. As. Are. Are, ¿verdad? Are. Ahora, para el pasado. Was, were. Was, were. Wait, wait, sorry. <laughs> I was doing something. But yes, como el compañero dice, was and were. Solo tenemos dos formas para decirlo, que es las que el mismo compañero está diciendo, que es was y tenemos también where. Ahora, <coughs> es sencillo entenderlas de la siguiente manera. Las que eran en presente am and is, en pasado van a ser was. Y las que eran en presente are, van a ser en pasado where. Ok, so this one is was. This one is was. And this one, where? Okay? Just to make that clear. If in the present was am, the past is was. The present was is, the past is was. The present are past, where? So for example, if I say this, I was a student, is the past, right? Or she was my friend, right? I was a student, she was my friend. But if I want to make one with R, you, we, they, this, but we go with R, they were sad, all right? So we're talking about situations in the past with the verb to be. Obviously, the simple present of the verb be means ser o estar. But in this case, we're talking about ser, era, and estaba, right? So that's what we're talking about, era y estaba. We're talking about the past. So I was a student, it will translate to yo era un estudiante. Then we have, she was my friend. Can you tell me the meaning of this sentence in Spanish, please? Ella era mi amiga. Yeah. The next one, they were sad. Ese es cuando lo mismo. Ella era mi amiga. ¿Quién era mi amiga? I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay. <laughs> okay, the next one that says they were sad. ¿Qué dice en Spanish? They were sad. Estuvieron tristes. Ellos estaban tristes. Ellos estaban tristes, right? Estaban tristes. They, ellos estaban tristes. Ellos estaban tristes porque no me conectaba a la clase. <laughs> They yes. were sad. Okay. So no sabíamos qué hacer sin usted, Miss. Eh, y se pusieron, yo, yo los encontré aquí bien formalitos. I, 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 yo sentí así que, que hasta ya estaban empezando la clase por ustedes mismos, right? Sin problemas, sin situaciones. Full Spanish, Miss. Full Spanish, I guess, I guess. Ok, so le the... pone dedo el compañero. <laughs> so the Ay, way that this, that this is going to work is we have the subject, right? Then we have the past of the verb. I'm hungry. Are you hungry, guys? No. No. Ya comieron. Yes. Lucky. Yes, me. Okay, <laughs> the past of the verb. And then we have a complement. That's it. That's it. That's the rule to make the simple past with the verb. 
Now, if we want to talk about the past negative, the, ne the same thing that with the present. We're gonna add not after the verb, okay? So we have subject, verb B, not, and complement. So let's make examples. The first one here that says, I was a student in the past should be, mm -hmm. I was not a student. Or we can abbreviate student. Oh, we can abbreviate this, and you know, we do this and we do that. I wasn't a student, I okay? Wasn't. I wasn't a student. So she was my friend. We're gonna say, she wasn't my friend. They were sad. In the past, she'll be, they weren't. Weren't sad, correct? Just like that. Now, to make questions, the same rule as always. La misma regla de siempre. A ver si alguien me recuerda la misma regla para hacer preguntas con el verbo to be. ¿Qué es lo que sucede? What, what is the thing we do? Remember or don't remember? ¿Qué es lo que va a cambiar aquí en esta oración? What is the thing that ah. is going to change? El verbo va de primero. Exactly. Thank you. So, yes, the verb goes at the beginning of the sentence, okay? Because it's a question. So, we have verb E, then we have subject, we have complement, and finally, we have the question mark, okay? That is the way we do it. Let's go here now. So, the first sentence is, I was a student. In the past will be, was I a student? Was I a student? And we have two possible answers because this is a closed question. We can say, yes, I was, or no. No, I wasn't. I wasn't, right? Pretty easy, super easy. <clears throat> okay. Just let me move something here. Para que tenga no tomen captura hasta que ya lo tenga así todo bien bonito. Y voy a poner arriba para que no se vea. There we go. Now we're talking. Okay. The next one says, she was my friend. What it would be in the question? Tell me. Make the sentence. She was my friend in a question. Tell me. Was what she? It, was yeah. she? Was she? Friend. My friend. Yes, I was. Oh, mm -mm -mm. the subject is she, so yes. Yes, she was. Yes, yes. She was. Or the negative that will be no. She wasn't. She wasn't. She wasn't. Okay, perfect. Now we go with the next one, right? Wait a minute. There we go. They were sad. In a question would be Were they sad? Were they sad? The answers can be yes. They they were. Yes, they were. Uh, or no, were no. They weren't. Okay. Perfect. Just like that. Así de sencillo. Vamos a poner unos cuadritos para que le puedan tomar screenshots. Si lo quieren mandar al grupo, you can do it. Voy a ponerle cuadritos para que se vea así como más llamativo. ¿verdad? Oh, no. No, I don't like it. Uh, like 
like that. And the next one. And this is for the rest of the class. I'm going to be listening. you. Okay. Ya pueden tomar un screenshot y mandarlo al grupo si gusta. Oh, yo se lo. Ok, perfecto. Ok, perfecto. ¿Ready? ¿Cómo quitarlo ya? Thank you to the people that have the camera short. Gracias a las personas que tienen esa cámara encendida. You know that that's always important here in the class. So I appreciate you doing that, okay? Now, we're gonna go, and we're gonna go work with the paths of was and where. Oh my God, I'm so hungry. <sighs> Take a minute. No, 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 I can't. Um, <laughs> Okay, so here we go. We're going to do one activity right now. Eso pasa que tienen tanta hambre que, o sea, sienten como que eruptan jugos gástricos. Perdón, verdad que se va tan gráfico. I'm so hungry. Voy a comer un banana. Okay. Anyways, as I was saying before, vamos a hacer esta actividad y vamos a identificar si vamos a usar was or where dependiendo del sujeto. Recuerden que si hay dos sujetos, por ejemplo, yo tengo María y Verónica, Mary, Mary and Verónica, ¿cómo podría ser eso en pronombre? Where. Where, ajá, pero they. ¿cuál sería el pronombre? ¿Sería? They. 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 Where, así como dice el compañero. Entonces, eh, hay que tener mucho cuidado en eso, porque no quiero que se vayan a confundir en cuanto a ese tema. Ahí les mandé el link, pero vamos a ver si me deja compartir. Ok, aquí está compartiendo. My mother, my mother, si yo lo pudiera reemplazar por un um, sí. subject, sería she, ¿verdad? Entonces, el verbo to be, que, que sería acá? ¿Sería? Wow. Was. My mother was mm -hmm. ill, ¿ok? So, eso es lo que van a hacer, identificando. No puede dar la respuesta a los demás porque sería demasiado fácil. So, le estoy terminado, comprobar mis respuestas y aquí arriba les va a aparecer su nombre. Me lo mandan, no vamos a tomar mucho tiempo haciendo esta actividad. It's super easy. Ok. ¿Se entiende lo que vamos a hacer? Do we get what we're going to do? Ok. Perfect. Yeah. Thank you. Um, recuerden que tengo ahí un par de oyentes que están... Silvia, ¿usted está de oyente? Pero creo que tiene ahí marcado como oyente. Porque tengo, I know... Lo voy a asignar manualmente mejor. Pero personas que puedan participar. Saben que van a ir algunos oyentes a las salas, ¿ok? So be ready with that. Okay, there we go. Ahí podemos ir ya. Thank you.
<laughs> Ahí está la invite para que se puedan unir. You have that there.
Ok, terminamos. Did we finish? ¿Todos terminaron? Yes, no? Yes. Ok, perfect. Now we're going to do another activity. <clears throat> ok, so here we have a reading and we have some questions. In this one, first we have here the same thing that I was explaining to you. Okay, we have how to use the verb V in the past. Okay, here we have we use the past of V to talk about situations in the past. With the subjects I, he, she, it, we use was. With the subjects the way we, they, you, we use where. Okay. Now we have the affirmative statements that I was telling you, which only add the verb in the past, was or where, like the training was very helpful, all the employees were happy to attend. And we have the negative statements that we can do it separate, was not, or wasn't, or were not, or weren't, okay? So we can say, it was not difficult, it wasn't difficult. Okay, we were not unwilling to help. We weren't unwilling to help. Help me reading the first example, please. Oscar, can you read this example? The training was very helpful. helpful. Okay, helpful, helpful. Helpful. Okay, Miguel, can you help me reading this one? Blanca, can you help me reading this one? Okay, read. Yeah, please. All, all the employees were happy to attend. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Okay. Clelia, can you read this one? It was not, wasn't difficult. Okay, thank you. <clears throat> Rafael Martinez, can you read this one? Rafael? No está? Okay. Um, Julio, can you read this one? We, we are not weren't unwilling to help. Okay, we were not willing to help. Thank you. Now, here we have a reading where they are using the simple past of the verb be, okay? And with the reading, we have some questions we have to answer using the reading, okay? So, let me read this for you. If you have questions about pronunciation, if you have questions about Okay, Veronica, I acabo de leer su mensaje. If you have questions about pronunciation or about meanings, you can ask me when I finish reading. Mari went to a training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting because she learned how to fix the equipment she uses and how to prevent damages on it. The presenter was really helpful and he clarified all doubts Mary had. He used a computer to present examples during the speech. Okay. Do you need me to repeat a specific pronunciation or do you need me to tell me the meaning of a word? Ramiro, tell me. Yes, Miss, please. Uh, hel helpful. 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 Es, eh, no es como con un, es como una O pequeña. Helpful. Helpful. Eso es ayudar. Eh, what's really helpful fue de mucha ayuda, dice ahí. De ayuda. Y eh, clarify. Clarified. Ahí estamos bien. Con del Clarif final. Clarified. Fight. Con del final. Ese es, fue muy aclaró, claro. Aclaró. Aclaró. Eh, doubts. Dudas. Dudas. Doubts. 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 
doves. Thank you, Miss. You're welcome. Miss, I have a question. Tell me, Sandra. The speech. The speech. Speech. The speech. How do you say in Spanish? Speech is discurso. Ah, uh, okay. Yep. A speech. A speech. Con e. A speech. Ah, a speech. Yeah. A speech. Correct. ¿Han visto la, la película The Speech of the King? El discurso del rey. Oh. No. Bueno, muy buena película. Okay. Anyways, so if you don't have any more questions, I'm going to send you the audio. Mary went to a training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting because she learned how to fix the equipment she uses and how to prevent damages on it. The presenter was really helpful and he clarified all doubts Mary had. He used a computer to present examples during the speech. Ahí tienen ustedes para que puedan ir a practicar lectura. Primero, eh, quiero que practiquen lectura antes de que se vayan a responder, ok? Before you go to answer. Pero quiero que pongan mucha atención en estas partes eh, del pasado. Eso es... Ya, yeah, that's it. Ok. You can take a screenshot and then we answer the questions. Después vamos a responder las preguntas basadas en esto. Pero yo quiero una respuesta completa. Por ejemplo, esto es un ejemplo, no digo que así sea. Acá me dice, how was the training? Y si fue malo, no me van a poner bad. Y eso es todo. That's not it. Okay? You can give me a complete answer. It was a bad training. Oh, it was a really helpful training. It was a good training. It was a boring training. Whatever. So you can give me full answers. Okay? Respuestas completas. Do It's we understand what we're going to do? Yeah, Julio. The question three, did mm -hmm. you like it? But did she you like it? it? She'll be she. Yeah, thank you. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, so estas preguntas es como que se las estén haciendo a Mary. Tendrían que responder ustedes desde la perspectiva de Mary, okay? Okay. Paragraph. ¿Cómo? Es depende, depende del... De, of the paragraph. De acuerdo al paragraph, yes. Al paragraph. Okay. okay, the answer, the number one, uh, is uh, the training Never was said. interesting. Yeah, the training was interesting, helpful, right? So you can use that. Julio, so did you like it? If she doesn't say it here, but we can think what she will say, right? That's okay. Because I think she liked it, but I don't know what you think. Okay? So okay. there we have it. Yes. Okay, let yes. me go. Tengo que ser muy cuidadosa con los grupos, ya que tengo varias personas que no están participating. Okay, there we go.
Verónica ya nos acompaña o sigue del de oyente. Eh, está en, en, no tiene salido el micrófono. Oh, ok, mándeme a una sala ahorita porque la gente no vino aquí, me tienen esperando. <risa> Vaya, ok, perfecto, yo la envío. Ahí estamos. Gracias.
Wow. No. No es ahí like. ¿Cómo no, verdad? Sí, 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 eso es. Estaba hablando por otro lado, Ramón. <risa> yes, I like the three. All those Mario have. He used a computer to present example during Ahí les he mandado equipment. más compañeros por si lo pueden eh, incluir en las actividades. Equip, okay. Equipment. Okay. Equipment. Equipment. She use. Hello, acá mandé más compañeros. Eh, Integrar las actividades. Please. Es muy dura la novela. Sí. Es mi esposa. Eh, Eh, 
y sala 2, ¿verdad? Yes. Sala 2. Miss, mire cómo nos quedó. Hello. Hello, Miss. Ok, the cleaning was last Tuesday in Guatemala. Yes, I like the training. Como la pregunta me la hacen en pasado, la tengo que responder en pasado. Yes, I like the training. I like, I like it. it. Ah, ok. Thank you. Ok, solo esa, lo demás correcto. Yes, good job. Gracias, Miss. Mm -hmm. Ok. Paso, pero... En las analizamos. Continue, please. Okay. okay. Mary went to training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting because she learned how to. Okay, so here's the situation. When we go to the breaker rooms, we go to the breaker rooms because we are going to practice. When I am here, I am speaking, <coughs> sorry, I am explaining and I am practicing my English. You, you should have said, people say, but, <coughs> When I send you to the breaker rooms, it's your turn to practice, right? That's yeah. your time. That's the moment when you can practice, improve, come like, I don't know, dialogue with your classmates, make conversation with them. Maybe ask them, ask them if you want, if, I don't know, if you have stops or you have questions, you can discuss that with your group. Why am I telling you this? Because sometimes when I send you to the breaker rooms, I hear nothing, nothing at all, <laughs> right? I could drop a pin and I can hear it. Obviously, ustedes de allá no van a sentir eso porque tienen ruido en sus casas. Pero yo llego a los breaker rooms y silence. Yes, I try to speak. Yeah, I saw you, I saw you. Nobody speak. Yeah, I saw you. And you guys, sometimes when your classmates speak to you, try to answer to them, okay? Because it feels bad. Believe me, me, as a teacher, I don't feel bad anymore. Sometimes when you don't answer, ya llevo tres, casi cuatro años de preguntar cosas y que no me respondan. Y yo digo, bueno, paso al siguiente, right? I do that. In my case. But when your classmates try to speak to you, try to answer, okay? Eh, intentemos responder porque igual se siente mal un compañero de que quiera practicar 
y que no practique con él, ¿verdad? Porque este es su momento. This is your time. Yo respeto mucho las cámaras apagadas y el requisito es que estén encendidas, pero respeto, ¿verdad? Miren, Verónica está trabajando y ahí nos tiene con ella trabajando con la cámara encendida, right Yo no les digo que todos pueden hacer eso porque si están en sus trabajos, yo entiendo a esas personas, pero hay personas que no estamos trabajando. Bueno, que no están, yo sí estoy trabajando. <risa> Que no, esté, que, que no está trabajando, ¿verdad? Y, y, y podrían encender esa cámara. Se los digo porque ustedes saben que es el requisito de la beca. ¿Ok? I'm not, um, no estoy regañándoles porque no puedo, right I, I cannot do that. Pero sí es como un consejo, ¿verdad? Que lo tomen a bien ustedes si así lo creen, right Es just an advice because practice makes perfect. Y nada, yo sé que cuando mando a alguna persona a un grupo, yo sé que esa persona va a hablar. Yo ya sé desde antes que vaya que va a hablar. Y la mando a un grupo para que haga hablar a los demás, right Por eso yo no dejo a los que platican, o a los que yo veo que participan, no los dejo siempre en una misma sala. Los mando estratégicamente a salas distintas porque yo sé que si los mando juntos a una sala, eso va a ser... Pero todas las demás salas... Right? And I don't want that. Yo quiero que sí practiquen. So I want you to practice. Esa es la cosa del inglés. No es como, por ejemplo, que si esto fuera matemática, si se van a hacer un ejercicio, silencio. The English is about speaking. Speaking, okay? So that's why I send you to the breakout rooms. For you to practice. That's for your own good. Por su propio bien, diríamos en Spanish, right? So let's try to practice and let's try to keep that ongoing because it's very important okay okay let me continue here i like to make the questions to some participants so um ramiro how was the training um the training was very interesting okay thank you ramiro and really helpful really helpful good job and clarify and clar clarify, okay, perfect. So three things, okay, perfect. Ramiro, can you make the second question to another participant? Yes, Johnny, please. Give us Thank the you, Ramiro. Number two, go ahead. Okay. No, 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 you ask, Ramiro, first you ask. Yeah, ah, yeah. Johnny, when was the training? Went to a training in Guatemala. So the training was in Guatemala. In Guatemala, yeah. Okay. Thank you. The training was in Guatemala, yes. Johnny, can you ask the third question to another participant? <laughs> Alfredo, ask the two. Did you like it? Yo creo ¿Sí? que Alfredo se acaba de incorporar a la, a la, sal, a la, a la reunión. Ok, de otro. Yes, Miss, ahí le mandé un mensaje al privado. Bueno, yes. aquí de Zoom. Yes, yes. Ok. <coughs> René, hazlo de estudio. ¿Te gustó? Sí. ¿Te gustó? Sí. ¿Te gustó? Sí. Yes, I like. I like it. Okay, yes, I liked it. I like it. Okay, Oscar, can you ask the fourth question to another participant? Um, Jocelyn. Jocelyn is, uh, está bien. No. José Alfredo. ¿Cómo me dice? José Alfredo. O sea, Alfredo se acaba de unir, no estaba en la actividad. Oh. Yeah. Excuse me, compañero, excuse me. No, vaya, le puedo dar opciones, le voy a decir quiénes sí estaban. Estaba Jacobo, estaba María Julia, estaba Jonathan. María Julia. Ok, María Julia, ok. Hágale la pregunta. What did you learn? I learned to prevent damage and how to fix the equipment. Good job. Very good. Okay, Maria Julia, yeah. choose the next participant and ask the question number five. Jaco. Okay. Jaco. Okay. And was the presenter help? 
the presenter was really helpful. Okay, good job. Thank you very much. Uh, Jacobo, can you ask the sixth question to another participant? Veamos quién. Mm. Ahí todos están escondidos. Yeah. En trinchera. Eso es bien challenging para mí, eso es un reto para mí. Bueno, le puedo decir, ah, quiero ver. Julio, está Julio, está mmm, Sandra, está... Sandra. ¿Sandra? Okay. Sí, Sandra. Ok, tal vez no me quedo sin internet, está viviendo fuerte. Ok. Did he use examples? Uh, use to present example during the speech. So he used examples. Thank you very much, Sandra. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you very much to everyone who participated. Gracias a todos los que participaron, todas las que participaron. That was really good. Un aplauso para todos ustedes. Un aplauso. Okay, good job. Ven como es de challenging, es como retador esto de, de la docencia en línea, <ríe> porque ya, yeah, hay veces me quedo sin estudiantes y está sad, pero miren, el punto es que estén acá, aunque estén de oyentes, perfecto para mí, porque están con sus minutos, pero después intenten también ver la clase, ¿verdad? Porque siempre queda grabada en YouTube para ustedes, por el beneficio de ustedes, y cuando podamos practicar, practiquemos. Si estamos de oyente, porque yo sé el trabajo o cosas, I understand, ¿ok? Que estén haciendo el esfuerzo. I get it, ¿ok? Sí, sé que... I'm sorry, miss. My internet is mad, bad, bad, bad. I, I know, Sandra, I know, Sandra. Se pudo escuchar. <laughs> I, I, I could hear that. But yes, ¿ok? A ver, uh, y varias personas sí me han pedido eh, para la cámara apagada, pero yo he visto a personas que... No las he visto en el mundo. And I wonder cómo serán sus caritas. I just wonder. Ok. So here we have a conversation where they are using the past, simple past of the verb be. So I'm going to read the conversation. You know already the first time that I'm going to read it is for pronunciation, second time for intonation. And if you have questions, you can ask me when I finish. Hi, Eric. Did you buy the spare part for the sewing machine? Yes, I did, Robert. The price was $78. Okay, I need the evaluation of the product. That's right, or of the new product? That's right. It will be ready tomorrow. Great. Did you order it online or did you buy it downtown? Yes, I went to get it by myself downtown. How was the customer service? It was nice as usual. So, do you have questions about pronunciation? Yes, miss. Or words? Sewing machine. Sewing machine. Sewing machine. Sewing. Sewing machine. Sewing machine. What it is? Excuse me. Máquina de coser. Ah, uh, the sewing machine is the... Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Another question? Yes. Um, eh, ¿Dónde está? I'm going to get my chat downtown. The customer service. Hey, ¿dónde está? The price, the evaluation. I need the evaluation of the product. Yo necesito la evaluación del producto. Eh, Correct. Verna. Correct. Okay. Maybe you're Thank looking you. for this word. Spare es una bujía. Es un repuesto. Spare es un repuesto. Uh, okay. Spare part, repuestos. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Okay. If you don't have any more questions, 
I'm going, oh my God, ya no, voy a, ya no tengo carga en mi teléfono. Okay, anyways, vamos a ver si le puedo mandar este audio. Hi, Eric. Did you buy the spare part for the sewing machine? Yes, I did, Robert. The price was $78. Okay, I need the evaluation of the product. Of the new product? That's right. It will be ready tomorrow. Great. Did you order it online or did you buy it downtown? Yes, I went to get it by myself downtown. How was the customer service? It was nice, as usual. Miren, esta palabra es bien interesante porque es customer. Aunque se escribe customer, se pronuncia al contrario. Miren, la O. Oh. Customer, customer, right? En lugar de customer, right? It's customer, customer. Excellent. Welcome, Carlos. We were waiting for you. Sorry for late. Oh, yeah, you're a little bit late, but you're here. Lo bueno es que está acá y cada minuto conectados cuenta, right? Okay. So, do you have more questions or should we go to practice? No me defrauden, les estoy mandando sabiamente, creería yo. I'm, I'm, I'm sending you to the break rooms. Let me see. En esta sala de aquí abajo. ¿A quién, ¿Quién habla aquí? Ah, ellos dos sí participan, ella también participa. Creo, creería que estoy tomando una sabia decisión en lo que estoy haciendo. Uh -huh. Quiero creer. Okay. Confío en ustedes. I trust you. Ok, there we go. Todas las personas que se han quedado aquí están de oyentes. Next partner. Hi, Ana. Next partners. Hello. Están de oyentes. Are you ready? Hay un paso ahorita para sí. que practiquen. Sí, practice. puedo practicar. Permítame. Sí, Voy a acercar el texto. Ok. Otro. Vaya. Eh... 
Yes, she's the person. Oh, see, okay. Hank, hi, Eric. Did you buy the spare part for the sewing machine? Yes, I did, Robert. The price was seven, seven, eight. Seven, seven eight. Dollars. Seven, eight yes. dollars. Okay, okay, I need the evaluation of the product. Of the new product? That's right. It will be ready tomorrow. Great. Did you order it online? Or did you buy a downtown? Yes, I want to get it by myself. Downtown. How was the customer service? It was nice as usual. 78. 78. 78. 78. 78. Okay, I need the evaluation of the product. Of the new product? Of the product. Of the new product. That's right. It will be ready tomorrow. Great. Did you order it online? Or did you buy it downtown? Yes. I went to get it by myself, by myself downtown. How was the customer service? It was, it was nice as usual. Okay, switch. So yeah, usual, usual. It was nice as usual. 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 Correct. Okay. Usual. I, yes, I, I did, Robert. The price was seventy-eight dollars. Okay, I need the evaluation of the product. Of the new product? That's right. It will be ready tomorrow. Great. Did you order it online or did you buy it downtown? Yes, I went to get it by myself downtown. How was the customer service? It was nice, has a usual. Okay, repita conmigo la última frase, María Julia. It was nice. It was nice. Con S al final. It was nice. It, it was nice. As usual. As usual. Ajá, esa palabra usual se va a pronunciar como que fuera con una IU al inicio. Usual. Usual. Ex usual. That's okay. better. Excellent. Thank you. The other participant.
Hello. So, thank you very much. I do really appreciate it because I saw more participation in this break room. So that was really good. Kudos to you. Así diría en inglés. Kudos to you. Kudos es como kudos. How do we, I don't think we have a word in Spanish for that. Pero como deditos arriba por lo que hicieron. That's something like that. Kudos. Kudos for you, okay? Thank you for participating. Thank you for improving your English because you are the main characters. ¿Saben qué es un character? Like an actor principal. So you're the main characters of this, of your education, your learning English, okay? So let me see. Hmm. I'm sorry. Um, Jacobo, thank you. Jacobo and Fernando. Can you do this? So Jacobo, you start. Fernando, you are Eric. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Hi, Eric. Did you buy the part for, part for the sewing machines? No está Fernando, ok. Uh, me le ayuda Ramiro. Yes, miss. Yes, I did, Robert. The price was $78. Ok, I need the evaluation of the product. Of the new product? That's right. It will be ready tomorrow. Right, I did you order or online or did you buy it downtown yes i went to get it myself downtown how was the customer service it was nice as usual excellent good job good pronunciations i saw there just something here for example you remember when we have a vowel sound we say d right the evaluation and this is the product course right the now, evaluation something that is okay. very important and i think i have explained this already but it, i can explain it again when we have this the kind of things we have the verb and we have the object right of the sentence we say that together okay so order it buy it get it okay all those things we say them all together order it buy it get it Instead of saying, order it, buy it, get it. You see, it sounds different. Order it, no, order it. Buy it, buy it. Get it, get it. You see, sounds better, okay? Let's go. But thank you very much, Ramiro and Jacobo. Good job. Good. Now let's go with Maria Julia and Ana Veronica. Okay. Uh, Maria Julia, you start. Okay. Hi, Eric. Did you buy the spare part for the sewing machine? Yes, I did, Robert. The price was $78. Okay. I need the evaluation of the product. Of the new product? That's right. It will be ready tomorrow. Great. Did you order it online or did you buy it downtown? Yes, I went to get it by myself downtown. How was the customer service? It got nice as usual. Okay, thank you very much. Un aplauso a los compañeros. Okay. Give them an applause. Okay, good. Bien, solo vamos a decir aquí, sewing machine. Sewing machine. Sewing machine. Now, um, great, great. Great. Great, great. Great. Now, the same thing, lo mismo que les decía a los compañeros. Order it, no es correcto. Right. Order it. Order it. Buy it. Buy it. Get it. Get it. Thank you. Vamos con Jonathan en Eric Josué. Jonathan, you start. Hi, Eric. 
Did you buy the spare part for the sewing machine? Yes, I did, Robert. The price was uh, $17.8. Okay. I need the evaluation of the product. Of the new product? That's right. It will uh, it will be ready tomorrow. Great. Did you order it online or did you buy it da downtown? Yes, I went to get, get it by myself downtown. How was the customer service? Uh, it was it was nice as usual. Excellent. Good job. Very good. That was good. Thank you. Now, <clears throat> let's answer these questions down below here. What did Eric need to buy? What did he need to buy? Spare part. part. Spare part for? The sewing machine. The sewing machine. What was the price yeah. of the new product? The price was $78. $78. How was the customer service at the store? It was nice, as usual. As usual. As usual. Excellent. Good job. Very good. Give them applause to you. Clelia, yes, aquí con nosotros. Yes, good. Excellent. Okay, good. Well, we're going to continue now. Give me one second. Give me just one little second. ¿Qué les parece si para evaluar lo que hemos aprendido? <risa> Se unen a ese link. <risa> ¿Les parece o no les parece? ¿Va a querer o no va a querer? Me adivinó mi hijo que me estaba durmiendo. <risa> para que vean. ¿Va a querer o no va a querer? Excellent. Estoy esperando, estoy esperando. Tengo only 11 participantes. ¿De cuántos que son? 26, 25. ¿Qué le me hacían falta al inicio de la clase? Se falta Carlos y Fernando, pero ya se conectaron. Ok, estamos completos. Excelente, that's good. Luminous, ¿quién es Luminous? Para saber quién va ganando. Sí, yeah. Yo, yo. Excelente, Jacobo, good name. Okay, I have only 14 participants. What about the other ones? Ramiro Alfredo Gómez. Who's Gómez? ¿Quién es Gómez? Who's Gómez? Sandra. Sandra Yanira Gómez. Maybe. Okay. Maybe. 
Charles, ¿quién es Charles? O Charles quiso poner. Carlos. Si es you, Carlos. Yes. Como que me le está fallando el audio, Carlos. Tengo a María Julia. Tené... Okay. ok, I think we're going to start con los que estamos. ¿Sí? ¿O me falta alguien? Espero a alguien. ¿No? Verónica se va a conectar. Sí, ahorita, ahorita voy a ver cómo me conecto, Miss. Okay. Ahí está el link. Hacemos una esperita a usted de un minutito ahí. Jenny's, oh, Jenny se nos conectó. Excellent, good. Verónica, ahí está. Ok, vamos a empezar. Okay. Yes. Good. Let's go. Rápido. Tenemos solo six, five, four, three, two, one. The weather se puede interpretar como eso, ¿verdad? Y para las cosas y animales utilizamos it. Por lo tanto, sería was. The weather was beautiful last weekend. Y no, no estuvo beautiful. Estuvo very hot. Excellent. Alex. Who is Alex? Nobody? Hi, Miss. Ah, Johnny. Okay, perfect. Good job, Johnny. Eh, Jacobo, Rafael, Julio, and Maria Julia. Let's go. Food. Food is the subject. Ya se acaba. Three, two, one, go. Oh, no. There was not any food. Food. Y son cosas no contables, ¿verdad? Creo que esto lo hemos visto antes. There is y there are. Nada más que quiera was. Oh, no. todo esto. Oh, my God. It changed the lot. Ana Verónica now is leading. En María Julia, Eric Reyes, Julio, and Jenny's. Nada está dicho. The students es un plural. Eso, 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 eso. Ah, okay, that's better. The students were not ready, right? Like they're they they were not ready. Rene, welcome to the chart. The car. The car is an object. Oh my god, qué rápido. <laughs> good. Oh, tenemos una que todos contestaron bien. Excellent. Good. That's good. Julio is going up. The teachers, teacher is a plural. Teachers. Uh, 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 oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh, oof, only one person got it wrong. The teachers were, because it's a plural. If it was only the teacher, maybe. Good, good, we're getting good. They sad day easy you guys super easy they were because they is plural oh my god unos tres personas pusieron was but it's plural next one oh ana veronica no oh se nos fue y ahora está julio leading the chart maria julia eric reyes rené y jenny it's okay okay Un error cualquiera lo comete, don't worry. <laughs> Kristen es una ella, es a she, so... 
Ah, ok, eso. Cuando todos lo contestan correcto, yo gano. That's good, that's good. Oh, Jacobo, welcome to the chart. Jordan and I. Sobran de dos personas. Jordan and I. Ah, excelente. Ah, siento que respiro más bonito. Ok, good. Next one. Let's see the next one. Oh, María Julia. Ah, María Julia is on top. The phone. The phone is a thing. The phone es una cosa. Oh, oh my God. It's quick. The phone was cracked during the last lesson. Was cracked. Se rompió, ¿verdad? Was cracked. Esa es la pantalla. ¿Quién puso? ¿Alguien puso where? Hmm. Oh, it's changing. Now, Julio is in first place. Maria Julia, René, Eric Reyes. Welcome here. Okay, you're doing good. The class, the class. Singular, 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 the class. Excellent, good. The class was angry about the test yesterday. Good job. Oh, Luminous is in the third place now. Ahora van subiendo por la rapidez, right? Ajá. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo abrimos pregunta ahí? The subject is you. Mm -hmm. Three, two, one. Bye. No, no, la mayoría le salió mala, no, es you el sujeto, o los que teníamos are is where, no, vamos a ver qué pasó en esa tabla, cambió, oh my god, it changed a lot, welcome Johnny again to the board, María Julia, Eric Reyes, Julio, and Jacobo, good, Uf. Y yo ni qué bueno que se equivocaron, dice. <laughs> we good students, we. Remember, we in the present is are. So the past should be. Where we good students. Good job. Nos vamos manteniendo ahora. Hmm, veamos si cambia esta tabla. The rain, the rain last night. Hmm. The rain, the rain, the rain, the rain, the rain. Do people got mistakes? The rain is a thing, but it was. Oh, now John is going to third place. Excellent. Batman. Batman. I am Batman. Tan, 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 tan. Yes, because it's a murciélago. <laughs> it's a thing, it's una cosa. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ana Verónica, welcome to the chart again. <laughs> Volvió. You, 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 you. What is the one for you? It's... Where were you last night? My God, it's you. Remember where, where? Oh, Jenny's welcome to the chart. Jenny? Muy mire, Jenny justo desde el example este Jenny. <laughs> pa 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 Oh my God. What was Jenny watching? Y se me desconectó alguien porque ahora solo 16 respuestas me parecen y éramos 17, éramos 17. We were 17. We were, you see, we were 17. I was happy because of that. Julio, it looks like nobody's moving you. Parece que nadie va a mover a Julio de ahí. Hmm. ¿Dónde anda Carlos? No lo he visto ahora. The student's last class. 
where from the students, the students, the students. Oh my God, ahí está. Ahí está el 17 que no me estaba contestando en las anteriores. Where were the students last class? Good job. Looks like nobody's moving, Julio. The car. It passed. Pam, 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 pam. El carro no iba o no era muy lento, era muy rápido. Good job, excelente. El carro creen ustedes que va lento. Do you think that is a slow car? Depende de la calle, ¿va? porque una calle con piedras sí es slow car. Punto dobles en esta. Oh, oh my God, the cat very active. Oh, lazy. My God, qué rápido. Puntos extra. Double points. Según la rapidez, aquí les contó doble. Ok, vamos a ver. <ríe> oh, Jacobo. Acaban de quitar de su lugar a Julio. Jacobo. Oh my God, eso es como un partido. Let's see. Punto doble de nuevo. Let's go. Pueden quitar a alguien de su lugar. Let's go. David, 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 David. Se acabó el tiempo. Ah. Ok. Vaya, vuelvan aquí a la sala principal para ver cómo quedó esta tabla. Mm. ¿Será que habrán quitado a Jacob de su lugar? ¿Será que Julio se vengó? ¿Será que alguien nos va a dar la sorpresa? ¿Will this be a surprise? We're gonna see, we're gonna see. Veamos. You ready? Solo una me equivoqué, mis. Eh, por la que lo hizo bajar. Me mandó al, como al 10, creo, de un sol. Y luego subió de nuevo. That's good. Vaya, vamos uh, a ver aquí la tabla de posiciones. Let's see. Claro, por la posición de la Good job, Johnny. Excellent. Después de estar en number 10. Julio, so that means that. The first place Jacob. for Jacobo. Oh, <laughs> Excellent. Good job. Vamos a Eric R. ¿Y quién más? Déjenme, ¿eh? No sé quién más. Pero perdí una. <laughs> ah. Pero fuiste más rápido que nosotros. Oh, yeah, you were faster. Quiero ver el podio. De nuevo. No, porque no puedo. Quiero verlo porque no vi los que quedaron en los cuarto y quinto. Pues Johnny tiene sus muñequitos bien felices de haber ganado. Es Eric R y Jenny's. Good job. Pero miren, esto estuvo bastante reñido. It was porque de repente María Julia fue en primer lugar, de repente otra persona iba a... was, Eso fue así bien crazy, ¿verdad? It was really crazy. Excellent. Good job. Now, we're going to continue with the attendance because it's the last thing we're going to do. Okay. And remember, tomorrow connect to the class, please, because we only have three more classes to go. That will be Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And that's it. Then we finish, okay? Okay, let me see. Ana Verónica Hernández Rodríguez. Present. Blanca, Blanca Isabel Tunaca de Rodríguez. Present, present, Miss. Ok. Cándida Luz Ortiz de Escalante. Carlos Alberto Meléndez Rosales. Present. Oh, antes de continuar, ya terminaron la plataforma. Yo finished. Ya la terminamos. Aquí? Ok, voy a... Sí, pero en mi caso, mi solo me falta un... en la plataforma que no lo pude Una. corregir, mis. ¿Cuáles? En, la ter... en el tercero, no, no, no lo pude corregir. ¿No lo dejó? No. Mm, qué raro, debería dejarla. Ajá, okay. Aunque ya alcancé el 80% según el programa ahí. Ok, voy a revisar las notas ahora. Uh -huh. okay. ¿Y Sandra qué decía también usted? Sí que solamente una, una no me no pasa y no sé por qué. Me salen malas. Sandra, 
tenemos que hacerlo porque ya lo hice yo aquí en el grupo porque ustedes me lo pidieron. Y no, yo sé, lo que pasa es que como no estuve en la clase anterior, por eso fue que no. Ay, pero ahí está el video de YouTube. ¿Cuál fue la clase? Lo hice ah. el viernes. Lo vi en Friday. Yes, viernes. Ah, pues la del viernes, ahí está. Ahí está la del viernes. En la, ¿Fue el de okay. último que lo hicimos, you guys? ¿O al final? No, al principio. Al principio fue. Ah, no, al que final. Que el todo examen, el video. Sí, que vas al final. Entonces, búsquelo al final. Solo un que es toda la una clase de que se Ok, ok. <ríe> bueno, continúo, I'm sorry. Clelia Estela Flores Hernández. Present. Eric Giovanni <ríe> Jiménez Canizales. <ríe> ¿Está Eric Giovanni? Ok. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Present, mis. <coughs> Fernando Salvador Figueroa Rosales ¿No está Fernando? Yo lo acabo de ver Ok Jacobo de Jesús Gómez Gómez Presente. ¿Quién? El ganador, ¿verdad? de winner <ríe> Jenny Carolina Vázquez de Medrano Present, mis. Excelente, qué bueno que no pudo acompañar por lo menos al final Sí. Johnny Alexander Escobar Calderón. Present, Miss. Jonathan Josué Oliver Enríquez. Present, Miss. José Alfredo Hueso López. Present, Miss. Jocelyn Angelina Ramírez Melgar. Present. Julio César Aguillón Arevalo. Present. María Julia Ramos Olivar. Present. Tengo una duda, María Julia. ¿Es Olivar o Olivar? Olivar, Olivar, Olivar. Como lo digo, ¿está bien, Olivar? Olivar está bien. Ok, excelente. Miguel Ángel. Sí. Miguel Ángel. El suyo es Oliva, ¿verdad? Ajá, es Oliva. Y el de ella es Olivar. Olivar. Porque estaba sí. Oli Uf. Olivares también. Ajá. Ok, Miguel Ángel Romero Hernández. Present, Miss. Oscar René Molina Calidonio. Present. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Present, Miss. Rafael Antonio Martínez Navarrete. Present, Miss. Ramiro Rafael Aguilar Díaz. Present, Miss. Ruth Guadalupe Asensio Arevalo. Ruth Guadalupe. Ah, está de hoy. Ok, sorry. Ok. Sandra Yanira Gómez Romero. ¿Qué acaba de hacer aquí Sandra? No sé. Sandra Yanira Gómez Romero. Hmm, el se volvió ahí. Se, se yeah. fue a ver el video. <ríe> Qué malo, Carlos. Silvia Patricia Aceituno Méndez. <ríe> Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas. Present, present. Okay, that was it for today, and I will see you guys tomorrow, okay? See you. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Have a good night. Bye. Bye. Good night. Bye. Bye. Have a good one. Bye-bye.